Entomopathogenic nematodes enter the pest insect through any body opening, such as the respiratory holes. Once inside, the nematodes make their way into the hemoseal. This is the substance that fills the body cavity. How does the nematode turn this potentially hostile environment to its benefit, killing the host and controlling the insect? A special cocktail that the nematode releases into the insect helps accomplish this goal. A part of this mixture is a specific symbiotic bacterium the nematode carries with it in a receptacle behind its mid-gut. The bacterium is released from the receptacle into the gut and eventually into the insect's hemolymph, which is its equivalent of blood. In addition to the bacterium, the cocktail contains proteins that help to break down the host's immune system, killing the insect rapidly, within hours to a couple of days. The key to the nematode's success, however, relies in its bacteria. Each species of entomopathogenic nematode carries its own specialized symbiotic bacteria that can only survive in the nematode or the host insect's body. In Steinernema nematodes, it is the Xenorhabdis bacteria. These bacteria multiply in the caterpillar and start producing enzymes. The enzymes break down the host's tissue and turn it into a nutritious soup that the nematodes then eat. When sensing this nutrient-rich environment, the nematodes proceed to develop into adults of both sexes. After mating, eggs are produced from which a new generation of nematodes hatch.